Jeremy, back in camp with the Ireland under 20s after the disappointment of the England game, but it's it's heads up now and all to play for against Wales this weekend. Yeah, it's it was obviously disappointing to lose to England, but um, we put that behind us now, and hopefully we can put in a good performance against Wales. One of the things that a lot of the lads have talked about is that that the coaching setup has given you room to play and room to be self-critical in a way. So, what was the post-match analysis like? Uh, yeah, it was really player-led and. We looked at how obviously there's chances to score and we didn't take them and I think leading into the next game we'll, uh, we'll look to improve on that and be more accurate. What do you know about the Welsh? Are they, are they a big pack or what sort of challenge are they going to bring? Yeah, I think especially up front they're, 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 they have some big boys and uh, they're really going to be trying to, to match us physically if not bully, try and bully us a bit. So I think if we can match them there and give our backs some good ball I think we'll be in for a good day like are you enjoying the whole setup yeah I'm really enjoying it this is a uh, it's been a good ch it's challenging me as a player and these games have been the toughest I've ever played so I'm really enjoying it Ross you're back in camp with the Ireland under 20s a big week ahead all to play for this weekend against Wales yeah um, obviously we're disappointed with the English win but just focus on Wales now and hopefully we can get a win get us back on track a lot of the talk from the camp has been about how the coaches are empowering the players. What was the post-match analysis from the players' point of view like after the England game? Uh, I mean, I think the players, when they are kind of shown the video, they kind of knew themselves. Uh, I think the biggest thing was probably not taking our chances. Uh, that probably cost us. Probably should have had two, if not three, tries in the first half, and it's probably the difference. In terms of the Welsh Challenge then this weekend, how much do you know about them? Uh, we know a good bit. Obviously, they've played three games now. They've had a bit of change with a few lads when called up to, to club duty and stuff like that. Um, they obviously be very strong at home. They beat England there and they've lost their two away games, but they'll be looking to bounce back. And in terms of the whole setup, are you enjoying yourself, enjoying your rugby? Yeah, yeah, it's been a great experience so far. Uh, obviously, a lot better when you're winning, so hopefully, we can get, get two more wins.